So how do we find out the PowerShell? If I need to open the PowerShell window over here on my Windows 10, this is a Windows 10 computer. If I right click, I cannot find open terminal here or open PowerShell here. Okay, so there is nothing to make me open the PowerShell, which is very important that I should, um, the PowerShell should open and take me to this folder path, okay? So I found an easy solution. I needed this to be able to create some, to issue some command line interfaces, uh, CLI commands for creating an ASP.NET project, okay? So what I found after a lot of research and a lot of failures is that, you know, all I need to do is to just backspace, clear this, and on this, this address bar, just write PowerShell. Okay. If I just write PowerShell, so it opens the PowerShell with on the same path as this folder is. So now I can start working. But if I am working on Windows 11, I don't have to bring PowerShell this way to typing it on the address bar. I can straight away get it by right clicking, and there will be a menu that will just like. It says open with Visual Studio, it will come up with open with PowerShell. So I thought that I should share this video because, you know, I wasted one full day yesterday uh, looking for a easier way to find how I could bring back the PowerShell or the Windows command prompt at a folder path. Because the other way was to this is the folder I wish to work. I can come back over here and copy here and then uh, CD to this directory. Okay. So I'm already on my C drive and then trying to come here and it will come back with this error. You know, positional parameter cannot be found that accepts the argument. Testing. That means I found that, you know, this entire folder integration testing ASP.NET 7. There is some space. So unless you have got a perfect path where you don't have any space between the two different words in a folder, it doesn't work. Or if I just go for um, like this single quotes, then I'm able to open to this path. So, C uses Kaushik. Okay. So, CD. And then this. You can open it like this. Uh, okay. Then I can do whatever I like. But then I have to copy all that thing. And uh, that will also be a bit more lengthier procedure. So, I hope that this helped you in uh, bringing. It's PowerShell window. If you're in a similar situation, if you have Windows 10 and you cannot get the PowerShell windows on your Windows Explorer to open in any way, so you can resort to this tactic.